Bill. Seriously, man? What? That's an idea. Don't mind it. Gentlemen, do you know why you're here? Yeah, for the murder. The reckless driving. Look, Mr. Jordan. Commissioner Jordan. Okay, Commissioner Jordan. Uh, I was the one behind the wheel. That's my bad. Actually, the reckless driving was a bogus charge. I knew you'd never come down here if I told you what was really going on. And that is... The Gente Mala Muerte. What now? Come on, guys, don't play dumb. I know you, Mute, worked for them for 15 years. Gente Mane Muerte? Not ringing a bell. Don't bullshit me, kiddo! I know you killed Hombre La Muerte. Oh, oh Hombre, that yeah. Guy, yeah. I... yeah, what does he have to do with the gerbil many muertos? Oh, Jesus Christ. Okay. Hombre La Muerte was the leader of the Gente Mala Muerte. How are you not getting this? Oh, I think I get it. Yeah, yeah. It's... Oh, thank God. Me neither. I, I can hear everything you're saying. So, uh, Commissioner, what do we gotta do with this? An old associate of yours, Mr. Barney Black, recently resurfaced. Our sources tell us that he may have serious connections to the Gente Mel Muerte inner circle. No, that can't be right. After all, Barney's the one that helped us take down that monstrosity of a crime ring. These meetings with known Gente associates and phone calls and such suggest otherwise. Like I was saying, since you killed Ombre, Mr. Black is the only remaining lead in the Gente case. So let me guess, you want us to look in the Black? Well, you two are the only people we know he trusts. Man, I don't feel right about this. Helping the feds take out a friend. Take down the Gente Mala Muerte, once and for all. It's not the first time I've heard that. Hopefully it'll be a blast. What's in it for us? Well, I don't take you in for the murders of Hombre La Muerte and at least 30 of his men in the last 15 years. Yeah, that, that sounds, that sounds right. pretty fair. Yeah.